Well, you could have bloody filmed it while I was chasing <laughs> him around the tree. Yeah, they don't look in great condition at all to me. Looks very good. Not bothered. Why look, I'm gonna do a handstand. Where? On this. On there? Yeah. Of course, you're gonna hurt yourself. You've got no travel insurance. Really? We're supposedly the most intelligent beings on the planet. And this is what we do for fun. <laughs> There's this little little street here, right next to the cathedral. Heaps of cafes, like nice looking little boutique cafes. Whole street of them, well nice. I believe this to be the most gothic looking cathedral I've ever seen. We found this little bakery here. Yes, please. Lots of nice baked goods, good prices as well. And this is in this sort of more expensive area, it feels like. We've got these oatmeal banana breads. I don't know if it's 40K for that whole thing because, well, I suppose it probably is, actually. Hello. 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 You know with this banana bread, is it a slice or the whole thing? Whole oh. Oh yeah, we get one of them. Yeah, can we have one of those, please? Yeah. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna. Uh, yes, please. Yeah. Thank you. Oh. Uh, take away. Uh, oh, we'll have, have it here. Oh yeah, okay, we'll have it here actually. Yeah. Oh, it's nice there. Yeah, exit there. Why not? Why not invade this person's private space? It's warm. Mm. Warm banana bread. Got a bit of chocolate in there. Oh, this was a good idea. Mm. Nearly didn't come in here. Yeah, do you know why? Why? Because you're a tight ass. No. Let's give this banana bread a go. It is warm. Mm. Good. Mm. Not overly sweet. Good stuff. Vietnamese coffee is very good. They use like coconut cream, condensed milk, coffee. Very nice. That's nowhere near as good as the one yesterday though. How disappointing. Mine's nice. Is it? Try mine. Mm. Now give it back, because you fucked up. Yours is nicer than mine. Yeah, yours is yours is, a bit, coconut yours is bland. Mine's glorious. What a great way to start the day. There are heaps of markets here as well. You can get all sorts of stuff. If you need flip flops, bags, loads of things that are made in Vietnam, you can get everything real cheap here. Nat just got this bag. 300,000 that bag was. That's really not bad at all. Well, we found a gym. There's a gym in here. I've never seen a gym in a botanical gardens before. Why look, I'm gonna do a handstand. Where? On this. On there? Yeah. Fuck off, you're gonna hurt yourself. You've got no travel insurance. Really? Yeah. <gasps> that looked like I struggled or not. 
I don't know. I don't know. I was, I was actually looking at you in real life thinking, oh my God. <laughs> Are you going to do it again? Ready? Oh. Was that your bones? No. That was a packet in my pocket. Oh my God. I thought you just your bones. <laughs> You know what they say about dogs looking like their owners. Oh my god, that's so funny. What do you want? They've got some skill, hello! hello. <laughs> They're good dogs, well behaved. <laughs> yeah, because this one looks like a honey badger. Impossible to get a push. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> yeah, it's pretty small in here though from the looks of it. It's way smaller than I would usually expect. That is the biggest squirrel I've ever seen look. Where? Where's the fucking squirrel? Oh my god. You could have bloody helped me. <laughs> well, you had the, he was running the same side as you, you're just he watching me chase him. Oh thing. my god. Oh, that was a cool looking squirrel. I've never seen that before. He was black with a red he tail. He was bleeding, but he wasn't. No, he had a red tail. Yeah, and no, he's all, the, all of the underneath of him was red. He had like a red really? stripe, yeah. Well, you could have bloody filmed it while I was chasing him around the tree. Well, i got to say, the Botanical Gardens is not really very... Uh, it's not worth going to. It's worth... Oh, I think we've had fun in here. Oh yeah, we've had fun. We've, we've had fun, but if you're, if you're, if you're uh, passionate about the well, Botanical Gardens, this one's quite small and not really very impressive. I don't know. I, I don't know what's up here. Come on. Let's go. It's quite nice in here. It's just not very big. There's probably a load of nice rare trees in here, but we usually go to the Botanical Gardens for you know, the nice flowers and stuff. I think this is a staircase to nowhere. Yeah. Gonna this... I don't really want to ruin his... Uh... No, I don't want to ruin his vibe. Ruin we're going to keep, we're going to go back now. <laughs> it's not, yeah, it's not very big. Yeah. As you can see, you've got the main road all the way around the outside. All right, well, they've got this. Got a peacock in there. Pretty small little cage. Pretty random as well. But if he tries fluffing up his tail, he's actually a nice looking peacock to be honest. Isn't he? Big green peacock. Okay, look at the size of it. It's actually like a proper peacock. I don't think I've seen a peacock like this before, look at it. Quite hard to... Uh, there you go. Look at the colours on it, man. Wow. The colours on it are insane. Oh, it's a shame he's in there, though. Oh, he doesn't like me at all. Look. It's game on. It's a nice looking peacock as well. I don't think I've ever seen one like that. He's got he's got like a green head. It's like a royal pink uh, peacock. 
fucking penguin. <laughs> oh, it opens up a little bit over here. Oh, it's a little bit bigger than I originally thought. I'm pretty sure there's monkeys in this exactly <clears throat> over here. Really? Yeah. Apparently there might be monkeys here too, in another cage. I suppose it's an easier way to bring in tourists than uh, upkeeping the grounds. Nothing. Why pointing at me then? I was pointing at the lake. Oh yeah, fun fact about Vietnam. Everybody gets tiny dogs because then nobody's going to steal it and want to eat it because they won't get much from it. True fact, look it up. If you have a big dog here, you run the risk of someone taking it and eating it. Yeah, the monkeys look pretty sad. I would say they look very sad to me. I don't know if it's just my own human emotion reflected back at me, but look at this. Look at the cage as well. You can barely even see in there. Oh, he's going to piss on you. He's going to piss on you. Yeah. She's getting some height on it. I don't know what kind of monkeys these are. And also, that monkey is really fat and monkeys shouldn't be fat. What? He's not fat. Yes, he is fat. He looks in bad condition. Look, his skin is all rolled, old, rolled over like that. He's got a massive sack of fat and skin and no fur. He doesn't look very healthy. No. In fact, none of them look very healthy. Mm, I'll try and get the camera in there. Yeah, they don't look in great condition at all to me. <sighs> Welcome to Vietnam. No animal welfare laws at all here, apparently. <clears throat> mm. Sad existence. There's no need for it either. You're not going to bring in any more tourists having these here. No one's got. Oh, look, there's a rat. Yeah, that's probably the one I saw. Oh, he went under. Oh, he's a massive rat as well. He's gone in there. Oh, shit. <laughs> Looks very good. Not bothered. Look at this. More caged animals. A load of bunnies. Hello, cute little bunnies. What are they going to be? Do you reckon they'll be food as well? Oh, more food. Oh, that's the reality of uh, the situation. Oh shit, they're alive as well. Little piggies. Oh, you've seen better days, haven't you, mate? Uh, well, we will eat meat. You'd at least kill them before you put them in that sort of condition. Maybe they're going to a, maybe they're just going to a nice new farm. We've got to cross the road. Come on. Bastard is on his phone, that's why. Now the surrounding areas of the botanical garden are actually quite nice. There are, there are government buildings there, which I think you can go in, but you need your shoulders covered and all that sort of jazz, so we're not really interested in that. So it's quite nice to have a little walk around over here, like, you know what I mean? It's quarter past three. I'm very hungry. A little bit bored of walking, to be honest. We've walked miles today. Need some good food. Um, you kind of got a choice. For bar me again? I don't know, it's a restaurant. Paris baguette? Yeah. Alright. Um, they do sandwiches in that. And other stuff, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I'm knackered. We walked miles today. I need food. I've only had them two bar meats today. It's quarter past three. It's bloody criminal. Should not be, shouldn't be living like this. Now, this place looks real posh. It's called uh, Paris baguette. It's right near the massive lake on the map. Everything looks so posh. You'd think this would be quite expensive in here, but look at these. 
£1.50 these are each. So this is a fancy place. I, I nearly wasn't even going to come in because it was so fancy. I was like, oh, fuck that. I'm not going to spend any money in there. But it's still actually really affordable in it, believe it or not. Definitely a fine art to that. You just have to go with the flow. Go with the flow of the traffic. Don't make hard contact with anyone and don't run and you'll be fine. Oh, he's caught a catfish. catfish. He, just, he hasn't even killed it, he's just left it. Look at his whiskers. Heaps of heaps of people around here and oh we've got a little bit, bit of cockfighting going on. I don't know if they're betting on this or if it's uh you reckon they are? Well they reckon they've just found two chickens and they're just both fucking each other up for ages. We're gonna fight to the death. <laughs> Oh, there's like, there's a kids, kids park right there. That means absolutely nothing here. <laughs> that means literally nothing. Here. There's kids right here as well. Crazy man, this place is nuts. Blow by blow account of the animal cruelty in Vietnam. <laughs> <laughs> We're supposedly the most intelligent beings on the planet. And this is what we do for fun. Watch two chickens tear the shit out of each other. Alright, I've seen enough. Let's go. Look at that, mate. That water is jet black. Looks like oil. It, it does look like oil and it smells revolting. Look at that, mate. That is pure sewage. This, this water connects to what that dude was just catching his dinner in. <laughs> this place is mad. Uh, another good thing about this city that I really like for walking is that it's not hilly at all. It's extremely flat. So you're never having to walk up hills and all that. It's, it gets a bit much, especially if it's hot. The good thing about our accommodation as well is that it's right next to the old quarter, which is pretty much the best spot you want to be in. Heaps of stuff going on. There's heaps of shows at night. There's events going on as well around the lakes. Loads of stuff going on here. You've got the train straight, train streets right there as well. But this is the sort of area you want to be in. And really most of the city is within walking distance and it's a lot of fun just walking through the city. Very tiring, but it is a lot of fun. And there's, there's so much stuff going on here. Like you, you wouldn't believe half the stuff you see. You walk around the corner and there's three blokes Standing around two cocks fighting. As you can see, it's absolute chaos. So I've got to walk it. I'm forced to walk in the road all the time. Look at this. Yeah. All right, we just walked into this uh, Europe village. No idea what it is. The music sounds alright though. Look at this. Oh, how much? How much is it? 20. 20? 
Oh, uh, ten? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we'll get one. Okay. Not this place. Mm. It's a bit sweet, but it ain't too sweet, is it? Yeah. I was expecting it to be mad sweet because it was. It looks real like goopy. Anyone in the comments from Malaysia? No, from Vietnam. Oh yeah. Vietnam. Whoops. Let us know. Because I ain't got a clue what this is. Because she doesn't have a clue what this is. Ain't. They're not going to understand. Alright, sorry. I don't know. <laughs> Um, because if it's condensed milk, it will be mad sweet, wouldn't it? Yeah, I think so, especially in that consistency. Yeah. It's really nice. I just don't know what it is. It's like it's, it's actually really nice. It's not like perfect amount of sweetness, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm. Pretty good. Wow, well that escalated very quickly. Oh, one of the kids took a plum from a bike and said it was too sour, so they didn't pay for it. And then the kid came back and took another plum. Woman went mental, they've all gone crazy. I don't know what the rest of the story was, what they were saying to each other. There was a lot of threats. They were pointing at the lake a lot, so I feel like somebody was going to get drowned. Oh, that was crazy. I can't believe we just saw that. She picked up the knife. Everyone was like, whoa. <laughs> oh, mate, that was mental. Wow. Welcome to Vietnam. <laughs>